So tell me, it's been a couple of months since we saw you last and you're still training for yep. Charity Squid for running the London Marathon. I How am. have you been getting on in the last few months? Training's been going really well actually. I'm loving it. So I'm training up to six days a week and um, a lot of miles. So on Thursday I did a 14 mile run to Aylesbury which was fun and I've got 20 miles to do next Thursday. Work has been great, you know, um, giving me a bit of time to run and, and I'm also running in my lunch breaks around Farmwell Reservoir which is I'm um, sort of doing about a four to six mile run every lunch break which is a good way to break up the day and now it's just really sponsorship and um, getting as much as I can and getting all my letters out and getting extra clothing made up to really get the squid logo and for London Marathon um, the squid logo there it is at the back. Do you want to read it, that for us? Um, yep, and it's www.squidsccwid.com. Um, and if you visit that site, you can then be linked through to my Just Giving website and then make a donation. And honestly, really, anything as little as two pounds or a pound is amazing, and every um, every little bit adds up. And it's great for this Oxford-based charity, Squid. So, can't wait. Okay, great. Thanks, Tammy. Um, you, you've also been. Um, Telling me a little bit about, uh, apart from your jacket, there are some interesting things that the London Marathon is suggesting you wear on the day. Yes, we've been sent red laces, which I think is an amazing um, idea. They've asked if everybody running the London Marathon wears red laces. So you can imagine 46,000 people running through London with red laces and their trainers, which I think would be pretty cool. <laughs> So the date again, it's the 26th of April, so 26.385 yards I think it is, um, I shall be running, can't wait.